rise in the Middle East, Jason. As expected, U.S. military bases in the region are on extreme high alert as American forces mobilize and naval fleets continue their path to the Persian Gulf. You'll remember it was August 2nd of last year. It took just two days for a man, some call the bad men of Baghdad, to invade the oil-rich country of Kuwait. Banks reporting. It was a day I'll never forget for a lot of reasons. I kept thinking to myself, this must be a dream. But I didn't wake up. I just didn't. The truth is, we live in a dangerous world. A world where the helpless call on the strong at their darkest hour to do what's necessary. I don't pretend to have the answers, and hell, I don't even know the questions. You see, it's my job. It's my job to do what's necessary. easy. Why? Because as the clock takes the politicians deliberate and the world waits, the bodies, the fucking bodies pile up in the thousands like human anthills. Hussein might not be a bright man, but I think he grew a brain on this one. Christ. Captain, I want Max team on the plant. And that's not up for discussion. Get on the horn. Do it. Services Committee, Captain. I believe I have proper clearance. With all due respect, sir, I believe you don't. 
That's ridiculous. I have level one clearance at Langley, the DOD, and Homeland Security. You're telling Look, me that I don't... Let's get down to brass tacks, shall we? SIL-6 is our first and last option in matters of counterterrorism. These men are handpicked by Mac himself, and no one pushes the envelope farther. Nobody. That's what I'm afraid of. McAfee is a liability. And this thing stinks of a political nightmare. Political. Yeah, political. You want me to sign off on funding this operation? And I'll tell you right now, the president isn't so optimistic either. Well, we don't train for optimism, Mr. Chairman. And you're gonna pay one way or another. I can promise you that. I don't think I like your tone, Commander. Then let me lay it out real nice. You're gonna pay professionals to get this job done. Men who are trained in these types of situations, or you're gonna pay to bury a whole lot of American boys. My boys. And that political nightmare you talk about is gonna get real dicey then. This isn't a game. No, I don't play games, Mr. Chairman. I train men to do what's necessary, and sometimes that's ugly. So fuck the politics, you got a choice here. The hell I do, you've only given me one option. Well, fortunately for you, it's the right option. And I'm supposed to take your word for it. Yes, I've trained these men, I know what they you know that. You Back realize what this is going to cost me? It's the only option. If I could interject here, sir. By all means. I'm sure you're just chock full of good news too, Captain. What the hell is your mission plan? One team, 24 hours. Truth is, Mr. Chairman, we could drop every bomb we got. We need men on the ground. Eyes on. What we need is definitive confirmation. These guys are real cowboys. Hell, we've tried to court-martial this son of a bitch twice. That's right. But these men are the best at what they do. And that's doing bad things to bad people. Black op shit, they killed two dignitaries in Serbia! Well, that's just bad company and bad luck, don't you agree? You don't have to deal with this shit! I'm ass deep in the problems these people have caused this administration! Oh, come on! Having lunch with five war criminals and an arms dealer is a good way to get yourself killed. Now that's cute. Real cute! One team. That's your plan? Yes. The sheer distance between these targets. The probability of these guys staying covert is not good, and you know it. And the intel we got suggests that the VX and nerve gas sites are now mobile for crisis. Yes, yes. We got ourselves a real situation here. Now, I can run this up the flagpole to my head. But time is something we don't have. The president listens to you, Mr. Chairman. Now it is time to let the big dogs run. And I mean right now. I concur, sir. 100%. Get McAfee on the comm and get him in the air. Yes, sir. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. Right off. Don't you dare thank me. Because you're going to owe me big time. And if this thing goes to hell and I go down, you can bet your ass I'm taking you with me. Hoorah! No. No, see, you've got to earn that. You have yourself a good day, Sarah. Mac, go for comm. Yes, sir. So comm code of relay waiting up with the USS Midway. Stand by. Midway. Where the hell are they? Davis. Persian Gulf. Strike distance easily in the next day or so. Three to four hundred sword is already filmed. Desert Shield. We're back in the game. You guys are aware that we're not supposed to be back in rotation for another nine days. I still got guys in the cover. That ended seven minutes ago, sir. Now, sir, we lost our comm operator Perkins. We're down a shooter. Replace him. Listen, Mac, we got a highly volatile situation developing here to go. I need you 
guys on that carrier by 0600. Do you copy? Mac? Mac, come in. I do, sir. Anywhere, anytime. You're damn right. So? Don't know. We got a hop to catch. Desert Shield. Make no mistake, folks. This ain't no panty waste grab acid. We are at war. In exactly one week's time, American and coalition forces will engage the enemy on Kuwaiti soil. 600,000 Iraqi troops and 2,000 mechanized tanks have been confirmed on the ground. Thousands have died, and I can guarantee you this. It's as hostile an environment as you have ever been in before. And we've got special forces on the ground right now as we speak. And more operators are going to be employed in the coming days. Mr. Saddam Hussein. Somebody kill him for me, please. He's gassed the Kurds 39 times. Killed over 5,000 of his own people. That was back in 88. But yesterday, he had the balls to draw a line, guys. He said if American troops, he's talking about you folks, engage his armies, then we will witness the, the mother of all battles. I think that's what he put it. The mother of all battles. Well, I guess he didn't figure on his daddy stopping by. Who are? You're goddamn right. I don't have go orders or a mission plan. Support? Today's mission, special ops. CL2 is already on board. They're flying us halfway around the world for support. That'll be the day. Where the hell is Tito anyway? Fort Bragg. He's testing our new jump rigs. Get this. The crazy bastard volunteered. Pretty crazy. Sounds like fun. He's coming. Davis. Grab a bag. Fuck yeah. Biochemical warfare is real, ladies and gentlemen. You remember your training. This here will save your life, but it will not prevent you from doing your job. And that's putting a boot in somebody's ass. Hoo -ha! You got that weapon on your side for a reason. We're going to use it. There's thousands dead. A lot of people dead. We will defeat our enemies, and we will not fail. Are we crystal? No. Yes, sir. Dismissed. Man, I'm supposed to jet in three days. I got two Brazilian honeys lined up. <sighs> Little bungalow by the beach. All the mojitos I can drink. Did I mention I have two Brazilian honeys lined up? Two. Damn shame. What do you think, Will? I think we should give him a pass and let him sit this one out. Yeah, just try to leave without me. See what happens. You and your honeys. My wife's got me home this weekend looking at drapes for the baby's room. Fucker. 6-5, this is Tyler. Back 
doesn't fix things. He breaks them. Push-ups? They don't teach you how to do push-ups in the Rangers? Yes, sir. I don't know about this new guy, Chief. I don't think he wants it. You might be right. Will, what's our count? 146, Chief. We're going all day, Davis. Why don't you just quit, newbie? Get yourself a cupcake or something. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit, if you don't want one, I'll take the motherfucker. <laughs> Get 
Look at that. The old man out shooting the young buck. Now that's <laughs> how it's done, boys. <laughs> you got any questions? That's how it's done. Davis, get over here. You dropped something. Uh, no, sir. No, sir. What are you questioning? You calling me a liar? No, sir. You dropped something. Welcome to the family, kid. Ah, what's up, brother? <laughs> Ready now, brother? Come here, come here, come here, Seal. Come here, Seal. You you're an ugly fuck. You're an ugly fuck, but I guess it's you're you my are brother. You're a good looking man. But you're a Seal, I'll tell you that. Thank you, so much. All right, now get off. Don't get shit. All right, congrats. Take care of this guy. Hey, Chief, wait up. <laughs> Love it with me, Chief. Take care of this guy. We're gonna be in a shitstorm soon. I can feel it. When we going in, Chief? I don't know. The fuck you don't. <laughs> I knew I thought we were gonna break you. Hey! What are we on vacation there? Get those mags reloaded and get back on that line! That soon, huh? So, uh, think our new boy Davis is ready? He's ready. Yeah? What'd I say? See, uh, my guess is we ain't gonna be tiptoeing on this op. Relax, Roberts. This ain't his first time out. The kid'll be just fine. Yeah, well, he's never been out like this. Never like this. This is Admiral Timmons. Go ahead, Mr. Chairman. We can read density in those canisters. Christ. That's twice the VX we anticipated right there. Well, I'm glad you're up to speed, sir. Are you calling to pull the plug or pull the trigger? Look, I know you sent for Max Team for a reason. I need you to co-sign and bottom line this, Admiral. Is this mission plan even possible? Because the last one was half as complicated, and it went to hell. Can they get this done? As you were, Master Chief. Sir. Gentlemen, I know you've heard the scuttlebutt the last few days. Air superiority ain't going to get it done. Not today. It's time to earn that handsome sour of yours. Sir, what do you need us to do, sir? Penetrate the city. Pinpoint targets for surgical strike. Captain? My guys will provide air cover. Spectre gunships, Tomcats, and stealth if you need it. I'm not gonna bullshit you. We're still working out the insertion of Jamal, our Iraqi contact. It will be hot. Time is critical, gentlemen. In four days, our troops will engage the enemy at the Kuwaiti border. And if that dumb son of a bitch decides to gas our boys along with the Kuwaitis, well, they're going to need to bring along a shitload of body bags. Sir, rules of engagement. Recon by fire. I was asked my opinion if I thought the Dom would even use nerve gas. I don't even remember my answer. And I don't give a good goddamn. Yes or no? Tonight, it leaves the playing field. Is that clear? Yes, yes sir. sir. Yes, sir. Good luck, gentlemen. You hop in one hour. This minute.
foot are you looking at? Man, you okay? Yeah. You? Good. You look tense, man. It's good. Really good. I thought you fucking said good again. I'll fucking kick your ass, motherfucker. That's still the fun stuff. For the ride, right? <laughs> Enjoy the ride. Yes. Drought proof. Afraid of shark states? No, sir. I'm not. <laughs> Sir, <laughs> <laughs> I just jumped like I'm not Hey, listen up. Let's do this right out there. No mistakes. In and out. Mistakes? Hell no. Who goes tonight, man? Hey. You feel like a gentleman going? This is just like training. Hit him hard. Fast. No footprints. Cover six. You can count on me. If you fuck up any of those calls, the birds stop coming. And if the birds stop coming, they just. We die. And before that happens, I will person. Put a boom square in your ass. GPS, show me. Two point eight range, three miles. It's gonna be a long night, gentlemen. A long night. Spacing. Tito, get on that ridge and tell me what the hell that is. It's go six, we got no Prove time! It. Davis, give me some good news. You can't do it, sir. The pass is locked. Full bunker, mounted 50s, impossible sniper cannon. Thank 
Half a dozen tanks, one half a click past that berm, 10, 11 tangles, and we're not going around. You don't even want to know what's over that ridge. Fuck. Call it, Chief. Hey, unless we plan on low crawling five miles, I say fuck it. We came to this party, let's dance. Go through them, gentlemen. On my mark. Davis. Yes, sir. Dial it in. We are going hot, gentlemen. Firestorm. This is Echo 18. We have six targets. 4 2 Alpha. T1 on the move. Northeast Berm is a sweeper. Whiskey 479 934. Clear for takeoff. Mission heading 1. Christ, man, you gotta be kidding me. 4 7 Alpha. 4 7 Alpha, repeat. You've you gotta be kidding out. me, man. Listen to that radio. Did the pilot hear you? Let me see that. Hey, 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 yeah, but the terrain bends right there. I do not need an explanation. Tito. You? Will, get up here! Tito, you and Will, I want you both to take that ridge. Yes, sir. All right? On my mark. Yeah, and I don't want anyone dragging any ass. You got that? Yes, sir. Chief. Hey, look. This is some fucking bullshit with newbie Mickey Mouse calling in air support for us. We all gotta die sometime, Slick. Yeah, well, if that asshole kills me, I'm gonna be fucking pissed. I got 50 bucks that says the pilot doesn't have to guide it in. You're wrong. Wait, how the fuck would you even know if the pilot guides it in? If it's off target, not gonna live to collect, brother. Davis, get up there. Davis, do that again, you're not gonna live through the night. You ladies can flirt later. Get your mind focused on the business at hand, please. I'm always focused, Chief. It's this kid I'm worried about. This is Black Knight 3 1, section of Warrington Room. DOT 5 Mike. Most aircraft carrying 2x2 two Mark 83 guns. Smoke on deck confirmed. 3 1, no smoke. Repeat, no smoke. Zulu request one minute out call. We are currently south 1,000 meters. Final attack code is 224070. Do you copy? Request in with heading to Mark. Per aircraft. I hope you got this right, one eight zero. Because we're about to shake the ground and wake up the dead. Clear hot smoke.
second pass coming. Get ready to move. That beautiful. Six, we are way behind to meet Jamal. Let's pick up the pace. Double time it, Slick. They're gonna see us coming. Maybe it's not him. It's him. Look at him! Kill him! Play it cool, Jamal. They are fucking him up. <laughs> Just on luck. Five mile swim, humping all day. Tanks, and now these fucks are gonna steal our ride? You gotta be fucking kidding me, Jamal. Hit somebody, you're 6'4. Hit him up now! Hit him up now! Hit him up now! Hit him up now! Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold up, Mr. Chief. Holy shit, you got this, man? Just ran out of options. Oh, they got radio. You feeling lucky, Mac? Would you two shut the fuck up, please? He misses that shot. We are fucked. Shit, that's gotta be a motto. Guy A. Told you. Mile under the wind? Walk in the park, Slick. Get the fuck out of here, Chief. Let's move out. Take a couple of carjackers. Fuck up. Come on. Sanchez Roberts. Get those bodies out of here now. You're late. 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 In case you hadn't noticed, it's the goddamn Wild West out here with tanks. A thank you would have been nice. So how you doing? Hey. Breathe, man. Breathe. Deep breath. Come on. Give me one deep breath. There you go. All right, mm. the papers, the medical papers, you got them. Where are they? Davis, 
Davis. Yeah. Get him. All right, Jamal, listen to me. Focus. Focus. Yeah. You don't have much time. All right? Get in the truck mm. and get us where we got to go. All right? Mm. All right. Let's get these guys loaded up. Hey, it's okay. Mm. It's over. You're cool, baby. Cool like John Wayne tonight. Huh. Hey, you skinny fuck. <laughs> you okay? Huh? I'm okay. Cool, baby. Huh? You okay? Cool. Like the <laughs> Let's move out now! Come on! Get in the truck! We need you to drive. Get in the truck. Kiss. I got it. I got it. Get in the truck. All right. In trouble? Hit this and duck. bumping your dicks up. If you get your head back in the game, when that door opens, we're gonna be back in this shit again. The guy up front, his balls are in the wind, just like us. Hey. He's Kurt. He lost 11 of his family members when Saddam gassed his village including his wife and his daughter. He's with us. Now, this is Major Beaver. This is my responsibility. Do you copy? I need five minutes! Got it! right now, Cass. I buried him 88 days ago and I keep him right here. That is all I can do. No, it's not! <laughs> we don't have time for this shit. I got it. You didn't cry at the hospital. You didn't even cry at the funeral. You can't even say his name. His name is Tristan. And he is beautiful. And he laughed just like you. And his daddy was his hero, Tristan. <laughs> this is what he looked God like. Damn it, Kassar! You don't think I'll remember what our son looks like? He has the name. I see him every time I close my eyes, Cass. I loved everything about him. He was eight years old, and he died, and he was my hero. My hero. I held him in that street when he took his last breath. Would you like to know what he said to me? What his last words were? Do you? It was an accident. You know what, baby? I love you. 
I love you. I love you. I love you. I love everything about you, baby. You are my world. You hear me? But all the tears and all the talking will not bring him back. You're not a robot, Devin. You're allowed to feel. You go. But when you close your eyes, I want you to remember one thing. When we married, I knew that there were going to be things that you weren't going to be able to talk to me about. But your son, our baby boy, is not one of them. Not today, son. Not today. Damn it, did you get him? Let's go! <laughs> hey, Chief, bird's up. We gotta go, Chief. <laughs> I gotta go, baby. Just please, one more minute. I love you, baby. I gotta go. Going bird shot, sir. What? Devin. Devin. What was the last thing he said to you? behind. Bounty hunter command. Zulu requesting type 2 control. GBU 
one six on alpha target. Knowledge and standby for nine. Nice Kill time five minutes. Do not be late. No kinetic on my mark. Spark along. Squad Sorzula confirming out the cargo. We are on the move. Go for strike. Lightning 4-5. New copy. Bravo go. Bravo go. Eyes on 400 meters. Bunker ID. Drop heavy. Drop heavy. Over. It's on fire. How's that? Four six, you're broken. Danger close. Go for fire mission. Not wait for Zulu. Weapons free. Say again, your weapons are free. Your weapons are free. Zero three zero zero nine zero. Your bomb. Your laser. Be hot. Your Sam one one seven at target Delta requesting. Fire mission over. Great for one. Target Charlie is going. You have marked your target. Give us 60 seconds. Tito, come back for Repeat, clear in 60 seconds. Go for Charlie. Woo! Very nice. Direct hits. You boys have put warheads on foreheads. Stand by for secondary targets. Zulu is clear. Copy one. Six one, I copy. Keep that night stalker in the air, and hit anything even remotely looking like a tanker coming from that location. Yes, sir, Mr. President. That's good news. We're looking real good. Thank you, sir. We got him. It's not over yet. Get Admiral Timmons on the comm right now. Tell him his boys did us all proud tonight. Every last one of them. miles away from our waypoint, Jamal. I got JSOC telling me we got three Iraqi platoons over this ridge here. What the hell is going on? Maybe your satellite is wrong. Maybe it's wrong? You trust me? You want me to go on a feeling? You trust me? Devon, do you trust me? Yeah, Jamal, trust me. Then trust me now. Keep it up and we might let you hang around for a little while. Thanks. I uh, figure you guys owe me 150 bucks a piece. And uh, I don't think you got credit. <laughs> Fuck that. Kids getting cocky, I like it. Son of a lucky bitch. What, 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 what is it? Got tankers and mass, Chief. Fucking Terminator ain't got shit on you, Jamal. Davis, call it. Paint it. Stay small. See, it looks like I think. Get the truck. Kill team six. We have a target of opportunity. Target of opportunity, Echo six. Three, Contact five. Rich. Nobody move. 
Shit, we got a problem. We got a problem. Chief, you're 9 o'clock. It's clear. I don't have a red pants and white shirt. You look like a damn kid, Chief. Oh, fuck. You gotta be shitting me. Hopefully he'll pass through. We got nowhere to go, Chief. Where the hell is Jamal? What the fuck are we doing here? Slick. This goes to help me get quiet. Again. Yes, sir. Move it. Uh, this is Echo 11. We need an immediate medical evac. We are in transport. We have a civilian down. Repeat, we have a civilian down. Fuck off. Medical support. Tito, I need you to clamp the goddamn artery, man. I need you to clamp it now. Halibi, 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 Halibi. You know you got three fucking uh, seconds to get the goddamn order. Uh, Davis, what the fuck? This is my medevac. Just hold on one second, sorry. Give me my it. fucking medevac now. What the fuck are we doing here, man? Please. Uh, 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 what the fuck were you doing out uh, here? Damn it. Fuck. Uh, uh, holding down, Chief. I'm trying. Give him a shot, boy. Yeah, he's going into shock. Uh, uh, Chief, he's got a fucking hole the size of a softball on his back. Uh, this is Echo 11. We need immediate medical evac. We are in transport. What? He wants what? We have a civilian down. Repeat, we have a civilian down. Davis! I need the goddamn medevac now! This kid is fucking bleeding now! Master Chief is coming, sir. This is my medevac! Just hold on one second, sir. Give me my fucking medevac now! What the hell are you guys doing down there? 
running a goddamn civilian mass we're unit. Not, we're not running a mass unit down here, sir. We have a, a Give me my civilian down in the immediate now. medical... You get your asses out of there now! Immediate medical... God. Do you hear me, son? Do you hear me? What the hell? Where is it? God damn it! I got it. I got it. God damn it, you don't got shit! Give me that! Give it to me! What the... What the... Breathe, God damn it! Do not die on me, God damn it! Good! Breathe! I had a boy! He was here! I am not! Gonna go for this! Come on, breathe, Tristan! Tristan! Confirming Zulu has I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I hope not. No. This is my responsibility. Allah is smiling down on this boy. Lives we saved this night. I will swear to this. That won't be necessary.
Wait a minute. He was whispering something. Before he died, before he died, he was whispering something. Jamal. Jamal. What did he say? He wanted to say he was sorry. choice. Master Chief said it was simple. The blood of a single boy for the souls of thousands. Maybe millions. To die so others could live. It's just another casualty of war. No name, a shallow grave, and a memory. Like he said, simple. Red out! Red out! Get the fuck out of the truck! We gotta get out of here, Chief! Let's go, Jamal! We got company! Let's move it! HQ, this is Zulu. We are abandoning transport. Holy fuck! LZ is cut off. Repeat, LZ is hot. Rally LZ Bravo. We will have contact. Fuck, this is gonna get ugly. That's at least a platoon, Chief. Shit, they got our flanks already. Use the trenches as cover. We cannot get pinned down. We gotta get out of here. Hold the line on my mark. Jamal, let's go. Stick to Sanchez. Yeah. 
containers. Hold this line down. Chief, go get him! Go get him! Choppers in the air. Hell, put seal two on that beach if we have to. Yankee 777 Coco, SRTS have been out for three hours, Commander. I don't think any of them made it off the beach. That's a seal team, pilot. We don't quit in this business. Now, I bet your ass every damn one of them's in that water. You keep looking. You understand me, son? I do, sir. Leave it, Charlie. I want to be optimistic, Mr. Chairman. If they're alive, they're wounded. But it died in the least of their worries. The temperature at night, sir, it's cold. Real cold. Close your eyes, man. Keep your eyes open, Chief. Come on, guys. Come on. Yeah. Look at me, Chief. Look at me. Look at me. Master Chief often spoke of making peace with things outside your control. About tough choices. 
Choices no man should be forced to make. The kind that holds so many lives in the balance you couldn't begin to fathom. And he'd tell you most of them were easy. The people that knew him knew the truth. He died about an hour later. Come on, Chief. Open your eyes, man. That back is here, man. Come on, guys, you're here. Fuck you, we're here, man. They're in the water. They're okay. We buried that boy in the desert for over an hour. The Admiral screaming on the comm. It didn't matter. The truth is, the Chief buried more than that boy that day. He also let go of a few demons from his past. You know what? I think maybe we all did in some way. The blood of two souls. First one out of the plane, the last one in the water. To die so others could live. I don't think the Master Chief would have it any other way. I can't believe he's fucking gone. I loved him, but I buried him, and that was 88 days ago. check real quick, wouldn't we? Yo, Mac, bring you and your boys down here and smoke this food, all right? That's what's gonna happen. Hey, 10 minutes, you guys. We have school in the morning. Okay. That's big bad mama wolf. <laughs> Go to bed, Dennis Escuela. Get on the horn and get seal team six on her too. Yeah, she won't know what hit her. Cause I'll be on top of that with a quickness. Hey, heard that. I love you, man. You know that? Yeah. That's not Put a real kiss. You know, I don't think she realizes I'm a SEAL Team Commander. I'm the Master Chief. I had a son in the his name was Tristan. You would have, you would have really liked him. To hell with the LC. The boy gets buried now. He was whispering something before he died. Before he died, he was whispering something. He wanted to say he was sorry. What was the last thing he said to you? 
He said he knew he wasn't supposed to skateboard in the street. He said he was sorry. Go hard, or go home. I'm going home. I'm gonna miss you, Chief. I'm gonna miss you too, kid. We fight for God and country. Somehow I just can't, uh, can't help but wonder if maybe God will forgive us for what we've done. He won't have to, Chief. He won't have to. Take care of yourself, kid. And you take care of my team. Because if you don't, I will personally put a boot square in your ass, soldier. You got me, Davis? Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. I had a dream that night. I dreamt that the world was a safer place and all the answers were crystal clear. Yeah, then I woke up and all I saw was darkness. I figured that at some point in everyone's life, they wake up and find themselves in a dark place. For Cassandra, that was about three years ago and plenty of days in between. You know something, though? I think the Master Chief did find forgiveness after all. And that little man right there? That's Devin Jr. <laughs> He's quite a handful. Cassandra told me later she knew about the pregnancy when we deployed that day. I guess she figured the Chief had enough to deal with. I don't know. Like I said, the choices are never easy. I love you so much. I really miss you. I just wish you were here. And little Devin, you'd be so proud of him.
At the end of the day, you stop looking for answers. You look at who you are, and what you stand for. You see, it comes down to sacrifice. A senator who learns the true meaning and realizes that freedom comes with a price. And it's paid in blood. It comes down to honor. Admirals to privates, and all those who served before them. Comes down to brotherhood, where your buddy's life is more valuable than your own, and that's okay. Men more than brothers. And finally, it comes down to courage. A courage to live on and do the best you can. Devin Jr. Well, he never got to meet his father and know the kind of man he was. He will. You see, he's part of all of us. Our son. He belongs to SEAL Team 6.